So uh, congratulations on all summers. Um, uh, middle distance, Connecticut Middle Distance National Championships. How did you find that race? Um, very tough. Um, I found the course, especially the undulations on the hills, is very tough. It was hard to find a rhythm. Um, it's very easy to sort of overcook it on some of the longer drags. So, and the same with the run. The run was very tough. Um, it just I came into came into T two and fourth, and um, I knew that Mark Horan and Liam Dolan were both ahead of me, and and Ian Farrell as well. So I knew that all those guys were really good runners. So I knew it was going to be very tough to try and pull them back. But I, I seemed seemed to run well. I had some problems with the quads early on, but managed to managed to come around and very happy with the way around. And the swim had to be cut short due to the cold conditions. Did that suit you, or was that a, a playing to your hands a little bit more? Uh, no, I'm a terrible swimmer, so um, it was really, really helped me. Um, to be honest with you, I'm I'm trying to gear up for for Ironman Austria, so I would have rather a, a longer swim. But I think the right call was made today. The water was so cold, and Oda, everybody was struggling in, in T1. Try I couldn't do the zips up on my gear and stuff like that. So it was definitely the right call, but and it did help me having the short and swim. It's a shame, but I think it was definitely the right call on the day. And overall, what do you think of the course? Is it a, a challenging course? Oh, it's a brilliant course. It's really, really good. Um, I think the, the bike course is really, really tough. Um, I, I would like sort of big hills and that type of thing. But um, as I say, it's kind of harder to manage your, manage your effort over the, over the smaller, lumpy stuff, um, <coughs> which makes for a really interesting race. And again, the run course is very, very tough. There's a, there's a lot of undulation and a lot, a lot of hills there as well, which, which make it tough. Um, it's a great, great location for it, as you can see. Uh, the lake is really nice. It'd be, it'd be nice if the weather was there and the water temperature was there for a full swim, but I think, I think the course is fantastic. When you turned up this morning, were you expecting to do so well, or what did you think of the level of competition here? Um, there's so many variables coming into today. The the race outcome depended on the format of the race. There's a lot of really strong bike runners, and there's a lot of really strong swimmers there as well. So, if it was a full length swim, then it would be likely that that things could have been different. Um, I know Mark Horn particularly is swimming really well at the moment, so Mark would have had a bigger bigger gap. Um, but like I, I had no expectations. I've, I've I don't really have any idea of what my form is like. I haven't really raced this year, so um, I'm, I'm just delighted with the way it turned out. And what are your plans for the rest of the season? Um, I'm doing doing Ironman Austria at the end of June, and then I'm just doing a bit of bike racing. I've been doing a, a bit of bike racing here and there just to stay sharp and really enjoying it. So I'm going to get Ironman out of the way and then, then switch over to bike racing for the rest of the year.